I hope you are satisfied with the quarters available to you. Go ahead. Do the honors. Sure. It fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's really It fits. It's just a table. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. We need a lot Here. more. You've earned this. Oh, Lisa, Welcome Lisa's to Constellation. Button. As a full member this time. Expected you Well, if you ever find a relic bottle from Earth, we'll all be happy to share it with you. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. Mm, yeah, um, maybe later. Fair enough. But before you go, first, there's an expedition that Samco has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. Okay, and so last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Talk to you later. All right, let's talk to her later. I am at your service, Captain. I want Captain, you. Now that you are a member of Constellation, also. Given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. Uh, do you miss Barrett? You could use your weapon. Captain, I will proceed to my assigned post. Fonty. Let's go. Ship. Let's go. Okay, let's go in the ship. Uh, actually, captain, uh, it is. Yes, captain. You're gonna follow me. All right, we are going to the UC. Is that right? To the military, anyways. We're gonna try to become a recruit, a successful one at that. There we are. Right, let's go. You had a mission for me. And that mission is something I am interested in. Let's see. Oh wow, quite a lot of main missions. Mantis found a note about secret outpost on the dead space. Uh, might be worth a red. read. Activities, constellation. Register for the Vanguard. Oh, let's go here. Uh, Vanguard Orientation Hall. Oh, oh so cute as that. Okay. Let's register. I agree. Okay. Registration accepted. You may now proceed through the historical display. That's quite easy. Or continue on to the examination. That's Earth losing its atmosphere, I think. Might be. No idea. Hey, that's Earth. With a weird disc on top. House for Rune, Free Star Collector. So these are the. Uh, I guess space farmers? The Serpent's Crusade, yeah, those conflicts amongst the stars. I think this was like the World War. World War? Of the many conflicts between the galaxy's factions, none was more brutal than the recent colony war between the UC and the Freestar Collective. Okay. Set off by the unauthorized oh, wow. Freestar colonization of Vesta's Pride in 2308. A direct violation of the Nereon Treaty. 
Oh wow. Armistice. Thank God is born. Oh, this is a lot like our ship. <laughs> it's one of these pilots, I think. One of those suits. Let's continue on. Okay. And some spaceships. Wow, these look amazing. I would love this one. This one looks a bit more like a dropship. Oh! Applicant, to the piloting simulation chamber. Please enter the designated simulation pod to initiate your exam. Exam? I didn't even study. Whatever. This is the Mark 18 flight simulation chamber applicant, currently in orbit around a high detail recreation of a remote world. When you're ready to begin, please take a seat in the pilot's chair. Your exam oh, is wow. simple. Defeat as many tiers of opponents as you can before your ship is disabled. You must defeat at least three tiers of opponents to pass the exam. Good hunting, applicant. New targets active. Quite a lot of power in the ship, which is great. Boost. Oh, we're getting some good hits. Locked on. Oh, jeez, the missile. I was pressing B. Okay, that's one, that's one, let's go. All targets eliminated. Progress recorded. Tier 1 reached. Initiating Tier 2. Okay, two guns. This thing is going fast. New targets active. New targets. Oh, we got three targets. Tier 2 simulated chip. Going head on. Missile lock on. Okay, let's go. Alright, fold her down, turn around, fire up. Locking. Locking. Fire missiles. Alright, we're 46 shield. She's regaining, she's regaining. Head on again. Right, he's almost down. He's almost down. Whoa! Missile lock. Missile lock again. Ah! Oh. Okay, that's one. The other guys are quite damaged as well. Seriously? Right, we left with again. Press E. I thought it was turning. No, get back in. You have to start over again. Oh, I swear. No, okay. 
That was not a smart move. That was not. Oh, these buttons are not set up well. Slow down so I can turn faster. Come on, slow down. Oh, I miss a lock again. There's another one. My boost is empty. Oh shit. Yeah, that's gonna be a hit. I need to evade. I need to evade. Okay. Shit. Oh, more to shield. To the angel. Oh shit, I actually took some damage. Ah, oh, I have to. Can I repair? No, I can't. Oh, I'm not doing good. I'm not doing too good. Oh, I can't repair. All targets eliminated. Progress recorded. Okay. Tier three. It was O, oh, not zero. Congratulations, applicant. You've defeated sufficient opponents to pass the exam. Oh. You may now exit the simulator through the hatch to record your current score, or stay and try your hand at the remaining tiers. See, so, yeah, I'll try. Where's the remaining tears? Resuming the examination. New targets active. Tier 4 simulated ship. Alright. Well, tier 4 simulated ship took a lot of my health. Or at least a shield. So I'm gonna try and regain them before I re-engage. Alright, he's behind the asteroid, that's fine. Alright, so let's save the boost. So, oh! Something happened to that asteroid. Uh, I don't know what happened to that asteroid, but it disappeared. <laughs> Okay, he's almost out. Oh, he's re- He's here. Let's not give him a chance. He's almost out. Spin around real quick. Alright, we got him. All targets eliminated. Progress recorded. Tier 4 reached. Tier 5, five. alright. Tier target's active. Alright, all right, so let's take out the easy ones first. Oh. At least I think they're easy. Oh. Keep going into targeting mode, scanning mode. Oh, they're strong. Right, 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 right. Oh, this is so hot. I can't repair fast enough and I can't escape them. I can't repair fast enough. Nope. Simulation. We're done. You, have passed, applicant. you may proceed to the exit hatch to log your results or restart the exam from the simulation's control terminal. Ah, oh, that was hard. That was hard. One level more, that was, that was the max. Damn. It's a shame. Yeah, continue. Oh, sorry. Exit simulation. I don't know what the bonus will be if I get a ship for defeating them all, because it was quite hard. It was hard. Congratulations, applicant. You've passed. You can head up to Commander Tuwala to receive your final results and your probationary assignment. Or you're welcome to take another run at the simulation if you'd like to try and earn a better score. No, I'm good. <laughs> we'll only keep your best run. 
Uh, let's go to the loop. Well, look who's back. Everything go all right with the exam? Or did you have some questions you needed answered first? Ah, so these are your numbers that just came through then. You ready to hear how you did? Sir, yes, sir. I like the fire, applicant. Let's get into it. So, looking at the data, checked out a few of the murals. Good. Inquisitive folks tend to do well around here. Psychological results are all within expected levels. Navy doesn't have room for folks that'll fall apart the first time they're trying to outrun a homing missile. Now, how'd you do against your foes? Tier 4, not too shabby. The techs make us test each level of the sim too. I can tell you that wave are some real artificial bastards. Good job putting them away. So then, looking at your results as a whole, and presuming you're successful in completing your probationary mission, you could have your UC citizenship after only... Ten years service. Pretty standard for combat assignments. But your performance in the simulator does mean I can offer a signing bonus. Help convince you to join the cause. Oh, so I get a so, high bonus? Sounds to me like we've got Vanguard material on our hands. Sounds like I get a high bonus to hire interested, yeah. we could bring you on as a provisional member today. Get you the credits you've earned, then send you out on your probationary mission. Sure, let's do that. First, though, all UC service people, provisional or otherwise, required to swear an oath so you want to make this official commit yourself to the cause of the colonies I'm ready fantastic then just follow me oh, I'm excited for this <laughs> bam in the lobby shut up let's get moving Am I the only recruit today? Um, is that how it goes? Oh, real wooden fl uh, floors. Dude, they're ruining it. Oh, uh, the other way around this time. Wouldn't be right doing this where we couldn't see the stars. Now, raise your right hand. The motto of the Vanguard is Supra et Ultra, above and beyond. That is where we serve, beyond the furthest reaches of the United Colonies military, and with honor and duty above reproach. Do you swear to protect and defend the citizens of the United Colonies to the best of your abilities, and to uphold the values of the Vanguard Honor, loyalty, self-reliance in all your actions as a member of the United Colonies Navy? Uh, I'm not really into big more commitment, but for you it's fine. All my actions... It's like, uh, okay, I do. Then let me be the first to officially welcome you to the United Colonies Vanguard. Now, only thing left is getting you that probationary mission. And what I've got is... comms repair. Group trying to refurb an old colony war processing plan on Tau City 2. Sounds like they'd barely gotten set up when their communications died. Place is as isolated as they come, so Brass wants a vanguard to deliver the repair suite and ensure anyone present is safe and secure. Okay. So, can the people of Tau City 2 count on you? They sure do. Oh, that's the spirit. Head down to the spaceport and talk to Crew Chief Harath. He'll get you the repair suite, plus your new recruit kit. Oh, and your advance. Give it your all out there. Supra et Ultra. Damn, 4800. Sweet! <laughs> and that guy's just sending. <laughs> by Vectera, by Vectera, by Vectera! Oh. I can't believe it! Is it you? Is it really, oh God, it's really him. you? Captain of the frontier, bane of the fleet, constellations shining star of stars. It's me. Then the day is truly blessed. Because for a moment, I wasn't sure if you were real or just another hallucination. 
But now that I know it's you, what are the odds? And to think, I almost went for coffee instead. But I changed my routine for one day, and here you are. Oh my god, this guy. It's almost like it was meant to be. It's definitely not. Are you saying I looked you up, tracked you down, and followed you all the way here? <laughs> Who'd be crazy enough to do that? I'd have to know what you looked like first. And now I do. Either way, it's such an honor. So you were my to meet. fan before hey, you even know how I look like? Do you mind if I follow you around? Do you need a sidekick? Nope. What am I saying? You're a hero, of course you what? do. Lead the way. Uh, assigning the adoring fan. No. Oh, I should have known better. Obviously, someone of your stature doesn't need I don't want you. <laughs> I'll just continue to monitor your exploits from afar. But hopefully, not too far. Until we meet again. Oh god, this guy. You accidentally hit me. Okay. Well, we know now that that does nothing. Right, so we have to do some grunt work. Uh, first off, let's put on our spacesuit. Constellation spacesuit. Oh, seriously, is this the army spacesuit? <laughs> <laughs> now let's just let's just keep our previous one. Ooh, actually no, let's let's keep the let's keep this space. Yep, yeah, no. Ooh, however, this one is yeah no. Let's 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 keep this space food. So uh, why why didn't I put it on? Yeah, put it on. Okay, great. So yeah, no, we uh <clears throat> that's good. Let's do some upgrades. Actually, let's. Rifle certification. Can we not get that yet? Why don't you use... Ooh. Oh, we need to get pistol kills first. For the other one to upgrade. And, oh god, there you have to fan. Uh, right, star map. We've got a mission, right? Right, we have to talk to a cruise chief. That's alright. Damn! Oh. Wait, that's not... Oh, that's our ship. Are we going with a different ship now? Or are we just getting our gate? Is that it? Could be. Hmm. Our new probationary then? Crew Chief Herath. Pleasure to be working with you. It's my job to make sure all you rocket jockeys are ready for anything that comes at you up there. Now, Manifest says we're fitting you out with one comms repair suite. In addition to the standard issue welcome kit all probationary pilots get for their first mission. Med packs, some small arms, couple spare ship parts, all the essentials in case of any surprises up there. My people will have everything on your ship before you lift off. Won't even know they were there. Hmm. So, paying a visit to the people of scenic Tau City 2. Nice easy one for your first job. Just keep your head on swivel and you'll come home safe. Okay. Any questions before you head out? Oh, uh, not really. I'm all sad. Nothing too dangerous, if that's your concern. The repair suite's mostly just wiring and circuit boards. The welcome kit has some goodies in there I wouldn't leave sitting around when company comes to visit. But it's nothing some proper storage can't make safe. Okay. Well, I'm all set. Then I won't keep. Make us look good out there. Uh, well, I wonder what we got. Because uh, we got it in the ship, didn't we? I think we did. 
Yeah, we do. It's all in the ship. Uh, that's fine. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna go fast travel. I'll check it out later. I'm not gonna put too much thought into it. Where is this mission? Oh, it's over there. Wow, it's quite a quite far. Fuel consumption twenty one or fifty three. Oh, it looks quite hospitable. We will take off our helmet here. <coughs> it's raining. Okay, let's uh, let's get up, and then I was going to check out the stuff in my ship as well. Are you coming with me? Any news to share? Let me know the next time you need my help. I wonder what she's doing mean uh, in the meantime that I'm. You know, do my stuff. Actually, let's see if the welcome package can I where can I access it? Oh, comes repair suite. It's a quest item. Okay, I don't know how it works. Let's just leave. Let's grab our pistol. In case we find any enemies. Wow. Oh. I meant to use the scanner. Some iron. That's a big ship. Oh sh something's been going on here. Break the place. Does computer say anything? No, it's just some crap talk. It's a chair. Alright, let's be on high alert. Something's going on here. Pharmaceutical lab. Can we get down there? Something not good has happened here. I lost the comms. Oh, that that ship is wrecked. Oh no. That cadet over here as well. Open workbench. Get down there. Let's see what's going on. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I don't think it's. I don't think it's just a hostile group that's been it. Oh, there's one of those droids over there, I think. Okay, so it wasn't an armed group. Ok, 
Okay, my buddy has to come in here yet. Uh, let's uh, let's grab some ammo. Let's close the door. So what do we got here? It's too clean to be one of the settlers, or a pirate. You see on patrol, maybe? You'll make my day if you said you were a shock trooper out for a stroll. Um... Vanguard, huh? Yeah, I expect they didn't. I'm Hadrian. I'm a... I was a researcher with the UC. I, I came here on a rumor of a... Well, I expect you saw the results on your way in. What's left of the settlers? The work of Oxisio Machina. A terramorph. One of the nastiest aliens humanity's ever crossed paths with. And this one, well, it's something of an anomaly. Possibly a worrying one. And, uh... Those, those things, we've, um... Yeah, we've encountered rumors about it in our second mission with the uh, Crimson Raiders. Uh... Terramorph, yeah. I sure could. Because to confirm my suspicions about this creature, I'm going to need a tissue sample from it. And to get uh, that... Ah, great. I need its corpse. Oh, is it one of those things... This but there is about? a way we can give ourselves an edge against this thing. The plant security system. The admin terminal's here in this building, but it needs its connection reset. And as I found out, that's not a one-person job. But if you can make it to the security outpost and restore the connection, I think I can get things back online. See if the settlers left us any other tools. <sighs> it's the building in the middle of the facility. The terminal in there should allow you to grant me access to the system as a whole. Then we can see about getting things back online. Good. Once I see the connection reset, I'll get things underway on my end. Take care of yourself out there. And make sure you leave enough of that thing for us to get a sample. Boy! You'll be happy about so far. Let's see. Frag grenades. Frag... Okay, frag grenades. Well, this is not gonna be a pistol mission. Uh, I just think Benny has any ammo. It's in the center. Oh, right, this map is useless. Let's see if we can find that thing and kill it. So apparently it already knows where I am at. Gotta put down a quick save here. God damn. Can't close this door, can we? Alright. Well, prepare to be shocked. Damage detected. Wait, is the one? Terminal in the adjoining room. 
Tune it to 183.5. And then it shows that it's right next to us. One eighty five. One eight point three. <laughs> Which one? Which one? Wait, let's see. Uh, in the mission status. Uh, status. No. Status? One eighty three point five, right. Oh. Oh. Trackers reading green. What's that sound? Oh no. Shit. Stop. Stop whatever you're doing and get in cover. It's on the move. Oh, it's close. Oh, it is one of the that you think Look, I wouldn't engage directly if you could avoid it. The kill lanes. They're set up but need power. There's breakers on each of the buildings you can throw to get them live. Once they're online, lead the terramorph towards the lights and watch the fireworks. Give it hell, Vanguard. Are you serious? Man, I don't want to be doing this. He's right there. At least he was. Oh, so he's one of the kill names. Let's regen some of our stamina. At least I got my buddy over here. Okay. Let's just take it slow.
stamina. This thing just makes a ton of noise, it just ignores it. Whatever. Right, Fasco, I hope you aren't already. Like three kill lanes. Oh, right, so because I thought this was the last one, but I guess not. One of, one of the turrets is already engaging, I think. Yeah, it's already engaging. I'm just gonna take my time. Oh, I'm encumbered? Seriously? Is that it? <sighs> Have I not been paying any attention? Uh, I'm not gonna throw away my pirate suit. But I'm gonna throw away uh, something I can't see. Let's see. Modified weapons. Equinox. Let's replace that one with this one. This one can be dropped. Okay. What's my weight? My weight's good now. Okay, my stamina's being normal now. <laughs> 72 meters, that's quite nice. Getting a bit closer. Don't know if the turrets are still alive. Okay, it's going further away. But we seem to be doing good. Just good. That's a ship over there, isn't it? Could be. I don't remember. Oh, it's getting close. Something blew up. Might have been one of the turrets. Oh, it went away real quick. Closer. Stand clear. Okay, let's save. <laughs> and now the battle's going. Oh wow, it's already. It's already done for. It's already done for. That was... That was easy! If that's it? Damn, really? Yeah, it's one of those big ones. Damn. Okay, well, that's all. <laughs> they put a lot of gas cannons to here for the fight, but like... <laughs> it took nothing. Trekker's gone quiet. I suspect it's either hiding or... Wait. You did it, didn't you? <laughs> Heavens above, you just flatlined a terror Man, that was easy. 
Uh, I think it was saving my ass. I'm not too proud. Thank you for saving my ass. You didn't happen to grab me a tissue sample, did you? Uh, here you All go. right. I spotted a microscope downstairs. Let's see if we can't get. And to then the rest office. comes. That's weird, cause like, why do you run so weird? No, it's wow. No, it's weird, cause like, how is it on every planet? Uh, planet I go to. Oh my god, Fesco. Fesco! Man, that was easy. That took no effort at all. Oh, I'm not expert. you can do running basic diagnostics nothing maybe a flag scan spectrograph this equipment it's not set up to do a proper analysis of our sample but this terramorph being here of all places it doesn't make sense Humanity's spread plenty of creatures in our travels across the stars. Pets, livestock, pests. But terramorphs? They're different. To our knowledge, no one's ever spread them intentionally. Yet somehow, they follow us. So when humans settle a world, 70 to 100 years later, terramorphs tend to just appear. No one knows how or why. Dangerous, but at least predictable. Talcetti, though, it's too young to have a native population. It's only been colonized 20 years. But then the other option, that someone captured one of the deadliest predators in the galaxy just to wipe out some settlers minding their own business? That seems awfully implausible. Which means we're either looking at a truly strange murder or a faster type of terramorph growth, the results of which could be catastrophic. Terramorph outbreaks have taken down far bigger colonies than this one. Hmm. Well, they're not exactly buying tickets and flying coach. The theory is that they're spread by some kind of egg or seed that's able to evade our detection. But how the hell an undetectable egg turns into a terramorph without anyone noticing is a question no one's ever found an answer to. And it's why what's happened here could be real bad news for the rest of human civilization. You're right. We just need more information first. Time was, I had access to one of the best repositories of Terramorph research in the galaxy. Seems a natural place to start looking, if I can figure how to access it. But we also need to get this sample properly analyzed, get confirmation on just how concerned we should be. Luckily, I think I know just the person to help with the sample. What would you say to delivering this to him for me? Yeah, I'd do it myself, but I need to call in some favors. See if I can't get access to that Terramorph data. <sighs> Plus, maybe just pop by a hospital for a little bit. Clear it with your commander first if you have to. You can even show them this. My gene tag. Tell them Hadrian Sanan is worried there could be more attacks on the horizon. They should recognize the name. Okay. Oh, you don't understand what a weight off my shoulders that is. I need Dr. Percival Walker to put together a sample analysis for this thing. Full workup. He'll know what that means. I'm not sure exactly where to find him, but last I heard he was contracting with the Trade Authority on Mars. 
There's a place called the Sixth Circle in Sidonia. A bar run by some old friends. I'll meet you and Percival there. Sidonia, oh. And here. It's not a lot, but you've definitely earned it. Should cover the cost of fuel to Mars, at least. Now please, go check in with your commander. We need to know what we're dealing with. Yeah, we do. <laughs> we do.